This BI Bytes series of videos is to show some of the business intelligence features of Microsoft's 2010 suite of products in bite-sized chunks. In this demo, I'm going to show you an improved feature of conditional formatting in Excel 2010. In Excel 2007, there are a range of options for conditionally formatting data, so you could get a view of your data at a glance. Here I have some cells in a spreadsheet populated by using the random function. Looking at the numbers, it's tricky to see where the high and low numbers are, so I use conditional formatting. I'll go to the conditional formatting button and choose to add some data bars. Now it's much easier to see where the numbers are high and low. So far, what I've shown you is also there in Excel 2007, but I can pick one of these cells and update the formula. I'll change this one cell to be negative. Excel 2010 now includes negative data bars in the conditional formatting. By default, we've got a difference in colour between the positive and the negative, so you can instantly know where you've got profits and losses, as well as seeing your data bars to see the high numbers and the low. Excel 2010 has improvements to conditional formatting to make it even easier to get visual indicators of your data.